Hello friends and family from around the world. This is Mike with Morning Dew Daily Events Worldwide. And we are on June 16th, 2021. And welcome to another surviving day on the planet. And welcome to the Volcanic Activity Report for week 24. As we are observing 47 active and erupting volcanoes across the planet right now. Volcano Discovery reporting 43 and USGS, Smithsonian combined, are reporting 47 active and erupting. Just looking at the volcano discovery map right now, pointing out the active regions and the alert regions. Let's start out here. We're going to name off all of the active and erupting volcanoes today, looking at Popo in Mexico. As well, active this week, Santiaguito, Fuego, and Picaya, all Guatemala, very active earthquakes as well. Masaya Volcano. And as well, ongoing eruption at Soufrière. South America here, Nevada de Ruiz. Reventador and Sangue and look at all the earthquakes just recently here in Peru so heads up South America as well Sabancaya moving further south into Chile Nevada de Chilean and as well Villarica been some sizable eruptions at Nevados de Chilean this week. As well, ongoing eruptions near Agongo in Africa. And near Amirigiria volcano is active as well. Ongoing eruptions at Piton de la Fornes. And as well, active to Ale Volcano into the Mediterranean where Etna Volcano currently changing due to its eruptive activity as well Stromboli some pretty classic eruptions this week over into North Sumatra here Cinnabung and as well the Carinchi I observed some steam and ash coming off of Krakatoa this week. As well, ongoing eruptions at Merapi, my most favorite volcano. Semeru. And as well, Urung. Through Indonesia. Moving eastward here. To Luatolo. Who on the 9th erupted. Quite a large eruption. And Dokono and Ibu through Indonesia, now up into the Philippines, where activity is being, minor activity being reported, the Tall Volcano, up into Japan, Japan, Swiss and Ajima, and as well, Sakurajima Volcano. Now Kamchatka, Ebeko Volcano has been active this week, as well, Karamiski. And Shivaluch is wide awake yet again since the 17th of May and producing a lot of SO2. Lucian Islands here, Semis Napochnoi, and as well the Great Sitkin still showing signs of activity. Island of Hawaii, Kilauea Volcano. And through Papua New Guinea, which has seen an active week as well, Cadavor. Manam, Languila, and as well, Bagana. Ongoing eruptions at Yasser Volcano as well. Just wait until I show you the SO2 maps this week. Right, they're not as busy as I showed a couple months ago. But here is our final active and erupting, the mighty Erebus Volcano in Antarctica. And I'm sure there are many more 
just not found or reported. So we're actively looking at 47 erupting volcanoes across the planet, showing activity, active or erupting. I want to thank everyone for joining Morning Dew Daily Events Worldwide, keeping humanity aware and prepared with weekly volcanic activity reports. This has been week 24, as we are just about halfway through the year. And thanks to all of the new followers, thanks for all the memberships, and thanks for all the support. Much love for humanity. Morning Dew, here for you. So now, Smithsonian and USGS here, I just wanted to show you, this is the list, 47 volcanoes continuing, eruptions, and here is your list. A couple of them I didn't even know about. This uh, Tofua in Tonga, and as well uh, Sondira in the United Kingdom apparently is erupting. So definitely going to be watching the volcanoes across the planet because, I mean, we are still learning so much about our past and even about our present and what can be active and what can be activated again. And always with the Volcano Activity Report, a little correlation with earthquakes, looking at just under 13,000 earthquakes across the world, according to USGS. And this is, re this is also reporting all of the small earthquakes through United States and not including all of the earthquakes up into China because there are many, many that are reported with Volcano Discovery, but not here with USGS. So recently, we're seeing a lot of activity through the Atlantic Plate this month. And as well, through Africa. Just under 13,000 earthquakes for the last 30 days. Also, I wanted to show you here a pretty intense hot spot through Arizona. And I've been a little bit suspicious about it. And I'm sure there are many that are a little bit suspicious of it. So watching this region here, it looks like the fire is growing westward. But both of these fires have been hanging around and burning for about five, six days now, if not longer. So I'm wondering if possibly a fissure is opening up in Arizona. Just like through California, Long Valley. There's so much stress right now we could see cracks in the earth opening up just like Iceland. I mean, maybe not particularly like Iceland, but it will be a very different eruption and catastrophic eruption if it does. Arizona is currently dealing with extreme heat conditions very early in the season. Looking across the globe right now, this is Null School, showing all of the SO2 particulates across the globe. High concentration through Europe. And as well, Southeast Asia, India. Increased emissions coming out of Australia this week. Very intense off the west side there and as well through Tasmania. Heavy particulates there, a couple regions in the north. Looking at quite a bit of SO2 across the Pacific Ocean right now, mixed in with all of the large low pressure systems. Intense cloud cover across the Northern Hemisphere right now. Let's have a look at Windy. This is the forecast model for the next uh, three days, five days, yeah, for the next five days for SO2, showing where the particulates will be traveling. You can see a lot of SO2 coming out of Kamchatka 
and as well the Aleutian Islands. Lots of activity there through Anchorage. You got to wonder what's erupting over there. Lots of SO2 coming out of Guatemala and Mexico. And that will be moving into North America this week as well. Lots of SO2 coming off of Chile through Argentina and Brazil this week. Intense plumes coming out of South Africa as well. 127 parts per milligram. Wow. So stay safe, heads up everybody, and please share this video with your friends and family. Keeping humanity aware and prepared with weekly volcano activity reports. And we are on week 24. Again, we are halfway through. And we've had already through the first six months an active and erupting 51 volcanoes. Right now, 47. Thanks for watching today. Stay aware and prepared. Stay young and have fun. And get your morning due. Bye-bye.